Alright guys, so today I'm going to be going from Noob to Pro with the new 6 tail 3 gen spirit in Shindle Life. So yeah guys, let's get straight into the video. Alright guys, you can see if I go quickly to the edit button, you'll see I look like the 6 tail gen Uh yeah, So I look, I just look a little bit clean here, I can't lie. If I go to Bloodlines though, I don't have it equipped right now, the Fume Bloodline. So we need to equip, I think it's Fume. Is it Fume? I'm not sure. No, it's not Fume. Uh, it's, oh, I forgot what it's called, but I think I scroll all the way down, I can find it. Okay, I've, wait, where is it? Oh, Okay, it's Fizz. So yeah, we do have Fizz equipped. I also do have the weapon equipped and I do have also the Tail Beast equipped. So we're going to go into the game now because we need to rank up because we haven't ranked up yet. So let's jump into, I'm um, pretty sure it's Ember Village. So let's jump into the Ember Village real quick. All right, guys, we literally just spawned in. And by the way, I actually forgot to record this. I already ranked up and stuff like that. So I already bought the Tail Beast and I already bought the Spirit or the weapon. I mean, the Tail Beast and the Spirit and I already equipped the mode and let's quickly go equip the Tail Beast. So yeah, I literally just leveled up and stuff like that. I put all my spawns into Tajutsu. Uh, so I can actually do a, a lot more damage or get a lot more XP when I'm hitting logs so I can grind a lot a lot quicker So yeah, oh, it's so annoying that I actually wasn't recording when I was doing the whole intro part But it's all good. We're just gonna level up now So yeah, we're gonna be getting to level 200 real quick because I do actually want to try this out later on in the video while doing PvP and stuff like that So this won't take us that long to actually level up because yeah, th this is actually like a very very good combo Plus, but I guess you do have to be rank S to actually be able to use this weapon because this weapon you do need to acquire 6,000 hydrates to actually equip the weapon and it's a very rare boss drop from the same mob and yeah let's quickly equip the mod real quick to check it out because i forgot the book is recording before well i wasn't recording so yeah i didn't equip it but here it is it looks super super clean here are the m1s for it uh i don't know if those are the m1s for the ninja tool or the actual thing i don't know yet but let's quickly check out the z spec the z spec is a, a tailed beast bomb there's amazing damage really really nice so yeah we're just gonna get level to level 200 guys i'm gonna be right back all right guys we're literally so close to get to level 200 we're literally seven levels away which i think i'm gonna actually stop right here so i'm gonna stop right here real quick auto clicker off let me click turn the chat off and yeah let's keep going going now okay so what we're gonna do now is actually what we're actually gonna do now is actually equipped a little bit of i don't even know what elements use i think he uses i'm gonna use what you know i'm gonna use water the element water because he just used bubbles so we're gonna equip the element water we should probably should have equipped at the start because i don't have water oh i do have a level up wait is it level up oh it's not okay so yeah we don't have a level up whatsoever so we have to level up water today uh let me quickly equip my stuff back on because it got removed and we got the first move of this phase of bloodline which is actually a pretty decent move let's go quickly do like a couple of like green scrolls like two three green scrolls here uh, i forgot to actually equip my stats and i do have some stats so let me equip uh 400 into here and the rest into chi i'm pretty sure that's what i'm you know what 150 here 150 there so yeah we're looking pretty pretty good and uh, let's quickly go find the green skull mission let's quickly mode up because this mode is crazy yeah this mode it's amazing guys uh what time okay so 500 to mode 2 and mode 3 is okay 1000 after that mode 4 is iron mode basically so we're gonna equip this mission here and go do this mission which shouldn't be too hard uh especially with this like weapon and stuff this combo guys is actually so insane uh, you don't understand how insane this combo is you have to go try it out for yourselves it's really really good but yeah tail beasts do level up a lot slower than bloodlines which is quite annoying z specs in general do level up a lot slower than bloodlines but it's understandable they're the secondary bloodline so yeah of course the main one's gonna level up a lot quicker but here we are after the first mission uh you know what tail beast bomb them easy easy way oh the oh i thought they died wow that would be insane if they died i'm um, use this uh yeah that movie is bursted and they're already dead yeah this is not going to be hard to level up whatsoever this is not going to be hard to level up whatsoever guys so yeah we're chilling right now i'm gonna go do at least two more because that one was really really quick and we haven't really tested it out that much you know what i want to try something now i'm gonna remove the the weapon and see if the mod has a q spec of its own oh it does okay so yeah i mean you know what? i'm gonna stick to the weapon i'm gonna stick to the weapon uh, at the end of the video guys, i'm gonna be showcasing the whole bloodline guys or the whole z spec do not worry the whole tilt spirit and the weapon and the mod the, the bloodline will all be showcased at the end of the video guys so make sure you stick so make sure you stick around for that but just quickly accept the mission before he does there we go we accepted that bad boy and we can go do that bad boy right now okay where's the mission it's right there shouldn't be too far all right they shouldn't be too hard whatsoever you should be able to like easily one shot these guys you know what i'm gonna be using the v move and then straight to tail beast bomb just killing them really quickly you know what i'm gonna actually use the weapon here let's just have the weapon boom ha ho oh my god this weapon busted oh my god okay this gave me a lot of fun i just one shot them with the key spec of the weapon holy uh, i think we're gonna do two more green skulls because that was way too quick you know we'll just do one more green skull all right here's the green skull that we have to do all right nice all right, let's equip this bad boy all right let's go all the way now to the next mission and quickly just one shot these guys again because yeah this is extremely easy uh i'm only able 250 which 
which is a lot doing these small missions um this high level already and like guys if you didn't know this when you get to level 800 i'm pretty sure everyone knows this when you get to level 800 in your life you start to get like so much more rewards and more xp for each mission so yeah this is going to be extremely easy to level up to max the problem is my tailed beast can take a while to actually level up so it'll be really z spec and then straight to v spec and they all should be dead there we go so yeah that was pretty pretty easy but yeah guys now i'm actually gonna go level up to max level try get my bloodline to max level i'm gonna, I'm gonna try but yeah guys i'm gonna be right back as soon as i hit max level all right guys here we are as you can see we managed to complete every single thing we need for today's episode guys i done so much grinding off camera i think it was two days of grinding just to get all the stuff here so we're gonna be jumping straight into a blaze village we're gonna be going to the nearest logs and showcasing every single thing in the mode the weapon and the bloodline so we will be right back as soon as we get to a log all right guys here we are to the nearest logs as you can see and here we are we've modded up already so i'm gonna quickly demod and showcase every single thing so we're gonna mod up to the form one of the transformation so yeah this is the six tail beast spirit and there we go form one it looks pretty pretty clean here are the m1s for form one guys are pretty pretty mid m1 not the best they do have some pretty nice it's like claws like you're like i don't know ripping through the air basically so it's pretty pretty nice it has some range to it i guess compared to normal m1s anyways that's a pretty decent range here's the q spec guys the q spec's pretty pretty nice you can see bubble uh, there's no e spec i don't think and there is a z spec which is just a tailed beast bomb so that's the first uh, form basically quickly quickly uh like i looked over it pretty quickly now to the second form which is a lot cooler in my opinion it looks like okay so the tailed beast is taking over your body a lot more in this so as you can see he's like taking over i love the gen 3 design it's so good like gen 3s are so so good here's the normal m1s the normal m1s are a lot better than the other one this has some insane range like some insane range it also has a lot more damage it just looks cooler in my opinion anyways here's the q spec so yeah you just it's like look at this just look at this so amazing and e spec there's no e spec i don't think oh there is an e spec okay i'm tripping but there is an e spec which is quite nice and here is the z spec guys so yeah it's in the tail beast and it's pretty pretty nice now form three which oh, this is where stuff gets a little bit wild form three here it is so you've just got taken over completely by tail beast you look amazing you look dangerous society i can't lie you look amazing and let's start the m1s the m1s are basically the exact same thing uh the e spec is like, a little bit different it just looks a little cleaner in my opinion and the q spec is a lot different as you can see this is uh, yeah this is nice and finally we do have the z spec which is pretty pretty insane too you go like this and you can aim this wherever you want it to go so i can aim it there 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 i'm pretty sure auto tracks the nearest person I, I think so not too sure so now before i showcase byron mode of this transformation we can showcase all the other stuff so let's start off with the v move or the first move is he's the first move of fizz so it's pretty pretty nice second move of fizz is this one so you just run up towards them it auto tracks and i think it auto i'm not sure but yeah, you can just move around in the air you can use it as a fast travel move too and finally the third move of fizz which is like yeah just auto tracks and it's super super good there's pretty decent damage too so it's pretty pretty nice and finally you know what no before we showcase the mode except in the end let's quickly showcase the blade of this so this this blade came out in the same update so this is the scythe for it let's quickly demod all the way down and let's check it out here the m1s for this blade guys so pretty decent m1s the optic on it is pretty nice you can even yeah the, and then you can just q spec it here's the q spec real quick uh yeah it's pretty pretty clean there's no e spec for this unfortunately but yeah it's it's a pretty clean weapon i guess and you have to be s rank to actually even use this weapon yeah so you can tell it's a pretty big deal this weapon is a pretty big deal you can combo it up with different stuff you can use this and yeah it's a pretty pretty nice combo you can use with but yeah finally i'm not gonna waste any more time quickly quickly unequip this so we can use everything for the form and let's move to buy remote state of the six tail beast let's go to do it three i used the wrong move uh, three two one and there we go we should be in form four which is the final form i'm pretty is it, is it form five or form four i think it's form four. so yeah this this is so this is it so let's check out the m1s the m1s are just a little bit crazier than usual just just a little bit you only have something the beast with you and you're attacking so this is actually pretty hard like to get hit in and yeah you can hit someone with mass it has an insane range all right here's the set spec for this mod z spec okay let's check it out here real quick and yeah you summon this beast and the herb this tail beast bomb i think and you just aim it around and stuff like that it's pretty good damage and uh yeah here's the key spec which is my favorite part about this mod you just crumble the nearest person or like the aim and then you just summon the tail beast and the tail beast just be chilling around so you basically have a boss with you and yeah it's like a companion and you can summon your own minakaze companion or something like that and it's basically a 3v1 so yeah with this you can 3v1 people so easily and here's the east spec guys which is just like a tailed beast bomb uh you charge it and i don't know why it doesn't release i don't know if, if it's a counter me or something like that but i never understand why that doesn't work it always let me try it one more time actually all right let's try it one time so let me try to hold it this time i'm gonna hold this uh let's see if it releases i don't think it will see it doesn't release for some reason i don't really know why but yeah guys that is basically it for the whole mod of the six tailed spirit let me know in the comments down below guys what other mod i should do and yeah guys thank you so much for watching this whole video i hope you enjoyed it make sure you smash like subscribe button and i'm gonna catch you all next time peace out guys